Hi everyone and what, welcome to another episode of Leisure World Model Railway. Okay, new this week, the main thing that I've done is put the fence along this side, uh, created a scene for the loading and uh, put the fence around the road and you'll see there's now a water tower, the Dapol, Dapol water tower uh, is in place. Uh, this is a motorised item. Uh, with sound which I'll show you in a moment uh, I had to hire it up and build a little uh, stand for it uh, because it was too low uh, and, and the arm this arm here which moves across over the engine wouldn't move because uh, it was too low so I had to raise it up and build this little uh, platform for it which I put some brick around uh, and added the steps so that's all my doing and obviously it's uh, been heavily weathered as well uh, or well, I've tried to weather it I'm not very good at that sort of stuff but I've made an effort uh, I've also put some uh, puddles in you'll see there there's one just there and one there now the puddles are just glass they're microscope slides so basically I just paint the baseboard uh, with uh, a dark colour underneath and then put this glue the slide down the glass slide down and then uh, put some uh, scenic materials over the top and it sort of glistens and makes it look like a puddle uh, it's quite very easy to do I uh, saw it on some guy's website on YouTube I've never been able to find the site since but uh, I I uh, watched him do it and decided I could have I could do that so I did uh, micro mic microscope uh, slides cost about five or on eBay if that so they're really cheap and you get about a hundred or so so I've used about five <laughs> uh, and yeah it gives a good effect to making a puddle okay so uh, that's one thing I've done as I say I'll show you the uh, water tower working in a moment uh, let me just show you some other things that have been done so I've the uh, Leisure World sign uh, here I've put one on the other side now here uh, likewise further up uh, on I've got one here and uh, uh, to opposite the original one that's up there uh, I've also uh, scale model scenery uh, did a review of some uh, parish council signs recently and uh, I had a pack of these so I decided to install them uh, so there's one here I already had them uh, when they did their they did a live build it's on their website so there's one there there's one here uh, and there's one under there here you can see that you'll also notice I've got a couple of TV cameras put up there uh, and also more TV cameras here so that's uh, where three of the signs are then up this end of the uh, build I've got uh, another sign here and one over here on the castle you can see that and Finally, as well as one, as well as the one here, there's also one here. So, so I've added those signs. Uh, someone made a comment on my uh, channel about the fact that the indicators on the car were not synced, uh, and they were the hazard lights, and they were all flashing independently so I've fixed that and those you'll see that they are now synced so that is fixed for the person who uh, pointed that out which I was aware of but uh, wasn't sure how to resolve but I've managed to do it so all the hazard lights are now flashing together uh, as they should on a car so that is now uh, proper and realistic let's call on that just release that so uh, there are the updates this week so let me just get a train in position and I'll uh, show you the Dapple water tower 
in all its glory. One moment. Okay, so we now have a, uh, a loco in position by the tower. So this is the Dapper Water Tower in uh, operation and uh, it comes with sound so it looks really cool as well as motor, mo as well as a motor so here we go Okay, there's different sounds each time, so I'm going to play it again and hopefully we'll get a different sound this time. They're random, so I can't guarantee what, what will be said, but uh, each one is different, so here we go. And there you go, there's the Dapper Water Tower. Uh, so I'm really happy with that, it's come out really well. Uh, and now, the only thing left to do on the layout really on, on this main bit, apart from the Alpine scene which I've got to uh, uh, work on next, the only thing left to do is this section just here. Uh, not sure what to put on here. I don't really want to extend the greenery because it's coming into the built up area. So I think I'm going to put some low relief buildings here. Uh, the only thing is that you see the back of them rather than the front because the front will be this side and you'll be having to lean over to see them if you if you know what I mean. So you're going to see the back, the back of them will be at the front of the layout if that makes sense. So not keen on putting on buildings but I think I'm going to have to because too much greenery otherwise uh, and I don't think it will go really when it's coming into a big terminal like here so I think it needs to be some low relief buildings uh, so that's probably what I'm going to do for that area uh, so that's it for this week uh, I think that's everything that I've done that I can show you uh, but if you're enjoying these videos, obviously please uh, share, like and subscribe. And uh, when I've got some more progress, I will uh, obviously post a new video in the coming, uh, in coming weeks. Thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you soon. Cheers and bye.